Welcome to the initial planning orientation. Um, this is where we launch your business with you, where we give you the, um, the very simple steps we're going to be taking with you to build this most formidable and amazing business with you. Um, on behalf of C21FG, Century 21 Freedom Group, I welcome you. Um, I would advise you to take a look at what we are talking about and, and um, do your best to, to grab as much as you can. I also want to let you know that the steps involved in running our business are very simple steps, very simple steps. We make bold to tell you that our business is eight-year-old friendly. What that means is that an eight-year-old child can run this business effectively, right? And that means that if they can do it, you too can get it done. Please do not complicate the system. Use the system as simple as we show them to you. And if you do that, you are going to be the most formidable business over a very short period of time. Now, this is not a get rich quick scheme, but this system can get you really rich really quick if you know what you are doing. We know what we are doing. We have done this work over a hundred years in combined experience to bring to bear, right? And use that to transform your own business. Please listen to what we tell you. We know you are smart where you're coming from. We know you're somebody that everyone looks up to where you're coming from. But this is our domain of play. This is where we are the masters. We know how to run this business more than you. Let us help you. Let us guide you. Let us hold your hands and let us show you how you can transform your life. I also want to let you know something. That you paid money to join this business means you need the money in the business. Don't talk down on the person who invited you, right? Don't out of pride begin to tell them, hey, you don't need the business, blah, blah, blah. No, that you paid means you need the business. And even if you make $5 million monthly, if this business pays you an extra $1 million, you will be able to solve more problems, right? So humble yourself, calm down. Let us show you how to build this most amazing and formidable business. I also want to advise you, do not question the system. This system has created millionaires before you. This system will make you too a millionaire if you follow the system and let us work with you. It is being said that in this business, the best copycat wins. And that's the fact. But the truth is this. You want to copy? You must copy the right cats. We are the right cats to copy, right? And I'm going to be showing you exactly what to do and how to create the success that you need to grow your own business. Welcome to part two of our initial planning orientation, right? In this section, we're going to be showing you how to do this business. The very simple things you're going to do to create the most amazing business. Now, let's talk about your expectations, first of all. Let's set some expectations right. I need you to understand that this is your business. It is yours and not mine. It is designed to pay you and not me. The money you're going to make from this business is going to enter your own bank account. Treat this business like you will treat any other business in the world which you need to take seriously. Give it the attention worthy of any business. Remember, you cannot make money from a business you don't pay attention to. We don't work miracles here. But if you pay attention and run the activities how we show you, run the activities with us, you will activate a miracle in your life. This business is a powerful system that is guaranteed to transform everything for you if you decide to pay attention to it, right? So you need to understand why you are in the business and set your expectations right so that you create the success that you are looking for in the business. Now, understand that if you succeed in this business, it will be you who create the primary architect of your success. You will be the one to create your own success and not any of us because it is your own business and it's the attention you pay to your business that will determine how much your business is going to pay you. Likewise, if you fail in this business, you are the sole cause of your failure. We have no part in your failure. You need to understand that at the end of this IPO, we owe you nothing else. I want to take that again because this is one place most people don't want to hear. At the end of this IPO, we owe you practically nothing else. All we are going to be doing with you is supporting you to help you grow. But if you want to grow your business, at the end of this IPO, you would have gotten all the information you need to build a 1 million naira monthly business and beyond. You will have gotten all the information in this system today, which I'm going to show you. So I want to use this opportunity to tell you, take notes as much as you can. Take notes as much as you can so that you can grasp all you need to run your business and succeed in your business. Don't let anybody distract you. This is the point where you need to clear all distraction, distractions, right? You will be the determinant between your success and your failure in this business. It is that simple. No other person is going to do that for you. So make the time to learn and run the business and don't make excuses. Don't make excuses why you can't do it. Don't tell us that you died yesterday and that's why you cannot come to run your business, right? The system we're going to be showing you are simple reproducible systems that you can run and transform your own life. And remember, 
You signed up into this business because of the hope it brings to the table. You need the money for whatever reason that made you pay. So humble yourself and let us work with you. I cannot overemphasize this. We've seen people over and over again who come into the business. They pay money to join the business. And when it's time to run the business, they begin to show us how proud they are, how they can't bring the time to do the business, how they didn't know it was a business, the not marketing business they signed up into, or whatever it is they were saying. Your presentation was done in English language, in a language that you understood, and you listened and signed up. So don't tell us that you don't know why you paid. You don't know what made you pay. You paid because you saw the potentials in the business. So humble yourself. Pay attention. Let us work this system with you. Now, I want to start by also letting you know that this is not your responsibility to go around talking to people for now. It is not your responsibility. That is the reason why a lot of people come in and they go out to military and start talking to people and when they don't get the result they're looking for, guess what? They run back and start crying foul. It is because you're going to do what is none of your business. Do not go about talking to people Leave that to us. You understand what we're talking about later, right? So let us clearly define our roles so you get exactly what I'm talking about. Our system for beginners is what I call an invitation-only system. It is your responsibility. It is not your responsibility, rather, to go about convincing people. Your job is to invite with our help, while our job is to show your friends the business on your behalf. We know this business more than you. Let us do this business with you the right way. Let us show your friends the business. Not you going about showing them the business. You don't have the result. You've not done the business. You don't know how the business works. You've not created any results. You've not created any leaders. We know these things. We know how to run the business. We are good at this. Let us do our job. Your job is to invite. And even that invitation, we will still be there with you to ensure that you invite the right way. Now, note that this is not a trading business. This is not a trading business, right? This is a training business. So we're not in the business of buying and selling. We're in the business of training people to become professionals, right? If you're looking for a business where you could be buying and selling and making profit, guess what? Go sell granuts. You make more money than selling our products, right? Because these products are quite pricey because of the class of products they constitute, because of what they are, right? So ensure that you are not in this business to do trading, but focus on the training. Also understand that this is a business, it's not a convincing business. This is not why we are convincing people to come to the business, getting people to go do things they don't want to do, no. This is not a convincing business. This is a consultancy business. Our job is to make the blind see. Our job is to create, become consultants. Our job is to show people alternative ways that can transform their lives. If they decide to take these ways and run it, they will create amazing success for themselves. If they decide not to do it, the Bible says the poor you always have in your midst. So you cannot force everybody to do the business. Our job is consultancy. If you go see a consultant in a hospital and you tell the person that you are having, um, 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 you are, you're not feeling well, you are having headache, malaria, typhoid, and the guy says, go and take um, 10 tablets of chloroquine, 20 tablets of fancy that, 30 tablets, and I just kill somebody now with that prescription, right? But all the same, if the consultant gives you a medication, if you don't take the medication, the illness does not transfer from you to the consultant. It remains on you, right? So the job of the consultant is to consult and give you what will help you. It is your job to take it. So it is in our business. Our job is to consult and tell people what can give them a most amazing life. If they decide to take it around with us, they will create an amazing life. But if they decide to explain it away and do nothing about it, no big deal about, no big deal at all, right? So we are in a business of consultancy. So you don't feel bad when somebody doesn't join you, right? Because the person did not see the vision for himself. I want to tell you, don't take it lightly because you have signed up into this business. Don't. You see, you are not the smartest person that saw this business. You're not the richest person or the poorest person that saw this business. You saw this business and you signed up because of the grace of God that opened your eye to recognize this opportunity. People better than many of us saw the opportunity, but they didn't sign up into the opportunity, right? Now, when I say better than, I mean in some you know, um, instances in life. They could have gotten better results in school. They could have more money than us I mean, as at that time. But they didn't join the business. Not because they didn't want to do the business, but because God didn't open their eyes to see the business. So don't take it for granted that you have seen this business. It's only the grace of God that opened your eye to see this business, right? So if you are talking to people and they're not seeing the business, don't feel bad for them. Don't feel sorry for yourself. Just calm down and keep on thanking God for opening your eyes to see this business. Let us discuss our three cardinal virtues, our three cardinal points in our business. The first cardinal point is a very simple one. You must commend your business to God. Everything rises and falls on God. Everything starts and ends with God. Without God, you can't have a business, right? Somebody wants to pay into the business and sign up into the business. And because you, you, you do not commit your business to God, that person's ATM card refuses to work. 
and guess what? He doesn't sign in, and then before you know what's happening, he spends the money, right? You need the grace of God upon your business to get that ATM card to work immediately. You need the grace of God upon your business to bring reasonable people into your business. Leaders who will build your business and create success with you, right? So always start by commending your business to God. The number one cardinal point of Century 21 Freedom Group, our business group, right? The number two, you must be willing to be trained. You see, we tell you that only professionals to make money. If you go to the stadium nearest to you, you will see, I mean, people who are boxers there, very powerful guys that can take, you know, um, um, Floyd Mayweather and Anthony Joshua and beat them at the same time, right? But guess what? They are not rich. They are not successful. They are not highly paid. You know why? They are not paid at all. They earn nothing because they are not professionals. They are, they are, they are amateurs. Amateurs don't make money. Money making is only left to the, it's only it's only at the domain of professionals, right? So professionals make money, not amateurs. So if those people can't make money, it is because they are not professionals. So why don't you spend your time becoming a professional, right? Mohammed Ali said, "I told myself I would rather go through the pains of training, right now, and forever remain a champion." And that's what you need to do. You need to be trained over and over and over again because you are about to go into a system that is designed to pay you a million, two million, five million, ten million monthly. Guess what? Nobody will give you that kind of money in your office to start with. Secondly, no, even if you will be paid in that office, you can just only just imagine the amount of training you're going to be put through before you become somebody that can earn that kind of money, right? So too in our business, you must be willing to be trained. If you want to move to the next financial level of your life, you must be willing to be trained. And the third one, you must be willing to train others. Because you see, this is the most beautiful business on earth. The only business on earth where the only way you can grow is by helping another person to grow. And that is our business. So the only way I can succeed in this business is by helping other, other people to, excuse me, is by helping other people to succeed. That's the only way it can happen, right? And how can I help you to succeed? By training them over and over and over again. So as you get the trainings, these are the trainings. As you receive the trainings, these are the trainings. As you train others, you get better. In a teaching environment, the teacher learns more than the student because he is the one teaching. The more you teach, the better you get, right? So you must be willing to train others if you must build the most amazing and formidable business. Our three cardinal points, number one, you must commend your business to God. Number two, you must be willing to be trained. And number three, you must be willing to train others, right? Now, this is the summary of our system. The long and short of the system I will be discussing with you comes down to this. Number one, buy the product through the business activations and occasionally orders as you may require. And you need to understand that order is not compulsory. What that means is that when you sign up into the business, you buy the product by signing up. The money you paid is used to sign you up. Your 49990, 79990, 129990 will be exchanged for product, will be used to give you products. So you've signed up into the company, you have those products, use them for yourself, right? Step two, use the products and enjoy the benefits, right? We tell you that the, the, the business behind our product will make you wealthy and the product behind our business will make you healthy. So use our amazing breakthrough product and enjoy optimal and amazing health for yourself, right? And of course, number three, connect your friends to buy the products by connecting to the business, using their products, and continue the channel of connections using our system. It's as simple as that. So what that basically means is that we create a network of users of the product, right? So step one, summary, buy the products. Step two, use your product. And step three, connect your friends to buy and use the products, thereby creating a network of users of the product. This is the summary of the system that we run, right? Now, the standard method of operation, which is a simple system we use to run our business, lays out simple strategies we use to grow our business. My advice to you is, Follow the standard method of operation. Do not argue with it. It doesn't require you to carry blocks, right? It doesn't, it's not rocket science. There are very simple things that you need to do. All you need to do to go through the standard method of operation is discipline. And guess what? Discipline is the bridge between goals and accomplishment. If you are not disciplined, you can't get anything done, right? Our system is called the triple four system, which simply means teach four teammates to connect four teammates in four weeks. This is a simple system that we have put on ground. And if you follow the system, the triple four system, you will create amazing results for yourself. The triple four system is made up of three components. We have the SMO checklist, we have the 444 system, and we have the challenge 36. And I'm going to discuss both systems, both, um, the, the, the system with you currently, so you see exactly what it's talking about, right? And if you pay attention and understand what I'm talking about, you're going to create amazing results for yourself. Right now, on one part, we have the normal way of running a system, which we call the 444 system, which any Tom Dick or Harry in our business can easily deploy and run and create a million dollars monthly within six months, thereabout. Right? But we also have the faster way of doing it, the fast track way of doing it, which we call the challenge 36. 
in which you can use and hit a million naira in about um, two months to three months, right? I would like you watching the IPO now to speak to your leader and tell your leader the path you want to go through, right? You can either go through the 444 system alone or you can choose to go, go through the challenge 36, right? And these are things, the way they're going to run with you. But either way you want to go through, it starts with the standard method of operation checklist called the SMO checklist, right? So I want to discuss our standard method of operation with you right now. Let's first of all look at the standard, the mentality behind the standard method of operation. We call that the SMO checklist. These are a list of activities that we have put together that we use to launch your business. It's a five weeks program, right? You can run it in five weeks or you can compress it and run it in one week. It all depends on you, right? But not more than five weeks. So that standard method of operation are laid down activities that we have put on ground, functional working activities that is, has been proven over and over to create millionaires. And we're going to be discussing these activities with you so you too can become a millionaire through this system over the next six months. So let's look at the mindset behind the SMO checklist. The SMO checklist, first of all, tells you what to do in our business. What to do in our business. You need to know what to do if you want to create success for yourself. Now, let's look at this example. I want to develop six packs, right? I don't have a clue what, how to, what to do to develop six packs. And someone tells me, you want to develop six packs? Go do exercise. Now, that is the what to do, right? So you want to build your business. You are going to be told what to do in the standard method of operation, right? It tells you how to do it, how to do it, right? Now, I saw a gym instructor. He tells me, go do exercises. And I went around and started jumping, jogging, doing whatever I'm doing. Will I develop my six packs? The answer is no, right? But when I look at the second level in the, in the second mentality behind the mindset behind the standard operation, it tells you how to do it. So the gentleman, the gym instructor tells me, you want to develop six packs? You have to do push-ups, sit-ups, crunches, right? And tells me to do all that. Push-ups, sit-ups, crunches. And guess what? I go back home. I do one sit-up, one, 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 one press-up, and one crunch. And probably I don't even do it the right way, right? So will I develop my six packs? The answer is no, I won't develop my six packs, right? Because I just knew the how to do it. So I've known how to do it, but then something is missing. That's the next mindset in the SMO checklist. The SMO checklist tells you the quantity to do, the quantity to do, right? So I didn't develop my, my six pack because I did one push up, one press up, one um, crunch, right? But now when I went back and told the gym instructor, I still haven't got my gym pack, gym, my, my six pack. He tells me, no, you don't just do it one, do 50 sit-ups, 50 press-ups, 50 crunches, right? So I went back home and I did 50 push-ups, 50 press-ups, press -ups, 50 crunches. Will I get my six packs? The answer is no, right? Because something is still missing. With the SMO checklist brings to the table, that's the final one. It tells you the duration to do those quantities to trigger success, right? So when I go back to the gym instructor, he tells me, do 50 sit-ups, 50 press-ups, press -ups, 50 crunches, do them daily for six months. If I do them daily for six months, I will definitely have some good six-packs on me, right? And the same thing with our business. You want your business to build up six-packs. Use the SMO checklist because it's going to tell you what to do, right? It's going to tell you how to do it. It's going to tell you the quantities to do. And the SMO checklist is going to tell you the duration to do those quantities to trigger success. This SMO checklist came about when people were asking us, I have signed up, what next? This answered the question of what next. That's why I will tell you that after this um, IPO, you have all it takes to become a millionaire, whether anybody works with you or not. Now, I am not saying we're not going to work with you. We're going to work with you all the way, right? But even if nobody is there to work with you, if you have gone through this system, you have everything it takes to win massively in our business, right? So let us focus on the activities of the SMO checklist because it's very, very, very important because these activities are designed to help us create the success that we need to run our business, right? Now on your screen right now is what the SMO checklist looks like. That's what the SMO checklist looks like on your screen, right? Each of you will need to make a printout of this on a, on a card, not on an, a regular A4 sheet, right? But you can have it on a card. If you have it on an A4 sheet, you want to also put it in a file. And it tells you the activities listed there for you. Now, on this SMO checklist, standard method of operation checklist, here you are going to write your name, your phone number, and your reservation code. And anybody you sign up, you need to get an SMO checklist for the person. Anybody who's paid that you, you brought in yourself, you sponsored, you need to have that person's SMO checklist with his name, number, and reservation code, right? The SMO checklist is being kept by your leader, 
who uses it to track your activities, right? Now you can see the SMO checklist activities, sign and dates. Under it, we have week one. These are the activities we're going to do with you in week one. I'll go through them one by one, right? And then for any activity you do, they see your, that place is signed and the date you did that you completed the activity is there. The same thing, week two is signed, the day you completed it is there, right? We're going to have that week two, three, four, and five. So these activities are written down there, which you are going to do, right? And the name and signature of your team leader is there at the bottom of, of, of the screen, right? So this is what we are going to use to, to run your business with you. This is our system. This is approved for all groups in this team called the Champions Team. This checklist is your guide to success. Never reduce the standards recommended in the checklist. Because you see, when you do something below the standard, you don't meet the timing. You don't follow the timing. You are now becoming the weak link in your team. When you don't finish the activities, you are becoming the weak link in your team, in which case you cannot build an amazing business for yourself. So let us look at the activities designed for us to do in week one of our standard method of operation. What activities are we supposed to do in week one of the SMO, right? That's what we're going to look at right now. So you're going to start your business by attending your first quick start guide, which also called that the quick QSG and question and answer session, which is the CAS, Q-A-S-S, right? Both are done together. So once the quick start guide is completed, you will be allowed to ask questions, different questions that you need to do. You need, you need to clear things um, for you, right? This is going to be week one. Now, you need to understand one thing about our business. There is no overdose in training. There is no overdose in training. In fact, in our team, we are more interested in celebrating the highest trainer than the highest earner, the highest person who is contributing to trainings. This is what is going to grow your business. It is who you become. Who you become is what's going to grow your business, not what you earn, right? So you become before you end. It's called you be have. You must be before you can have. You must become somebody who can make a millionaire before you can ever begin to think about making a millionaire, right? So you must attend your first quick start guide. You must attend your first initial planning orientation, right? Your first initial planning orientation. And then you're going to make a name list of 150 people from your phone contacts alphabetically. Now, this is very simple. This is very, very important. Don't say you don't know anybody. Don't tell the person who invited you into the business that you don't know anybody. His research has shown that an average human being knows about 150 people. <clears throat> and by the way, they are in your contact phone, contacts, they're in your phone, right? So don't bring out those names from your head. No. I know right now some of you are thinking about three sharp guys in your head. Philip, John, Bartholomew. That's not how it works. Open your phone, start from A, write down everybody you know, just three groups of people. Everybody you know, write their names down. Everybody that knows you, write their names down. Everybody that will remember you when you explain to them, remind them who you are, write their names down. That's practically everybody in your phone. Start from A and get to Z, right? If you have on, if you have got to number 150 and you've written only leave up to letter P, keep on writing until you get to letter Z. Do not stop. It's for your own good. The more names you have, the healthier business you are going to build. Because you see, anybody you're not inviting, some other person is going to invite them. And let it not be that some other person will sign up your wife or your husband into the same business that you are doing. I've seen it happen before, right? So make a name list of everybody. So you're going to write their names, draw a line, write their phone number, draw a line. You're going to write their location, where's what state they are, right? Lagos, Abuja, Kano, wherever it is, draw a line. You're going to write um, their relationship with you, right? Their relationship with you. And then you're going to write their status. What is their relationship with you? Relationship is, you don't use friend as relationship, right? If your name is Peter, I can have 10 Peters in my phone. And if you write Peter friend, and somebody's calling me on behalf of Peter, I'll say, which Peter is that? But you want to go in depth and describe the Peter. You want to say, Peter, um, we work together in Zenith Bank. Peter, we are the same choir in church. However you want to describe it, do a small description of who Peter is. So when we call on your behalf, because we are going to call many of them on your behalf, when we call on your behalf, we want to tell them, okay, I'm calling on behalf of your friend Peter. He worked in Zenith Bank with you. And the guy say, okay, yes, I know the Peter you are talking about, right? So please write it that way. And when we come to status, we use status to rate who we are talking to. There are three ways you can, you, we can, you can write the status. You can use M-A-N, M-A-N, the acronym MAN, right? M stands for money. It means that person can afford to pay one fifty thousand naira to join the business. That is M. A stands for authority. It means that person has authority over people. It can be a military um, general, it can be a HOD, an imam, a pastor, or something like that, right? Someone with authority over people, right? And then the last one is N. N stands for need. People who are in need of money because they are broke or people who need the product for health benefits, right? So those are the last category of people you write their names. Now, guess what? We want to start by talking to the people who can afford the business, right? Now, if the man is a rich pastor, he's, he's, um, 
um, status becomes MA, money and authority. If the guy is a broke youth president, right, having authority over a fellow broke youth, his status becomes AN, right, authority and need. So you want to write that clearly for us. We want to see the M, we want you to write the names, their phone number, their location, your relationship with them, and of course, their sta the status, right, their status. You will need to understand our duplication model using the 444 system, which I'm going to be explaining to you within the next few minutes in this same training, right? And you need to get your tools, very important. You want to get your diary, the diary of the current year. You want to get your hardcover notebook. You want to have the success manual, right? You want to have a smartphone if you don't have one. And probably you might want to have a phone for making calls too if you don't have one, right? Now, these are not, those phones are not really compulsory, but if you want to really build your business like a professional, you want to be able to separate your business from your private life and give yourself a most powerful system to work on, right? Now, what do you do with your diary? We use the diary. That's the most important part of our business. We use the diary to track our business. By the way, the 150 names you're writing, you're writing it on the hardcover notebook that you are going to buy, right? Now, you, you're going to write out, use the diary to track everything that you are doing in your business. I'll give you an example. If you invite your friend into our business, let's say for instance, James, you invite James to see our business and James comes in, he sees the business, he likes the business, but he doesn't have the money to join right now. And James says to you, you know what? I'm going to join this business in on the 5th of july what do you do you want to go into your diary and go to the 5th of july and you want to write call james he saw our business said he will be signing up he doesn't have money for now and write it down there if james tell you i'm going to bury my dad when i come back i will sign up into the business you also want to include it there he said he's going to bury his dad so you want to write call james and put james phone number there right then write what you discussed with james he said he's going to bury his dad he will come back and sign up into the business why do you have his phone number because you see, your phone can get lost. Your phone can be stolen. Your phone can even fall into water. Your phone can discharge on the money you need to make that call. But your diary cannot discharge. Your diary cannot be stolen, right? So you write that thing in your diary. And at the beginning of every day, you want to open your diary and treat the content of your diary first before you do anything for the day. We have what to call our daily method of operation. You treat the content of your diary first before you do any other thing for the day. When you do that, you see that you're going to build your business properly. Now, when you call Jane on the 5th of July, guess what? And it tells you, you know what? I'm not ready now. Give me to the, 7th, to the 20th of July. You want to cancel Jane's information from the 15th and move the information to the 20th, write it there again, and then you now include that you called him. He said you should call him on the 20th, right? So you want to include everything. And for any activity you've done, you cancel it. You call James and James did not pick and you need to go call other people. Cancel it and move the activity to the next day or to two days later, right? And write it down again in your diary. Always work from your diary. When you work from your diary, you cannot miss appointments. You begin to have this amazing professional look that keeps you successful in this business just because you are doing this business like a professional, right? So don't try and hold everything in your head. Remember what they said, that the faintest pen is stronger than the strongest memory, right? So make sure that everything is written down in your diary and you use your diary to track your business. And of course, the success manual is another tool you need very, very well, right? The success manual contains all the scripts you need. I designed the success manual. It contains all the scripts you need to run the business. That's what will tell you that after today, you have everything it takes to run your business and succeed. It takes everything. All the possible questions people are going to ask you is contained there. How to answer them is contained there. How to invite people is contained there. The words to say is contained there. The scripts to use is contained there. Everything is contained there. Yes, we are going to do a lot of these things for you at the beginning. But over time, you will learn because you too will now begin to work with your own people too and help them to succeed, right? So you need to learn it and you need the success model to help you learn it. And of course, we want you to remain in the business. We want you to understand what awaits you in the business. So you will read the introduction and chapter one of a book called Your First Year in Network Marketing written by a gentleman called Mark Yannell. In the whole of week one, you read just the introduction and chapter one. That's all. That's enough time for some people to finish two or three books. But we'll ask you to read only two chapters in the whole week. Don't rush it. It's baby steps, right? That's the first thing you need to do. Read it. And when you're done reading it, you need to summarize it and send a summary to your leader, right? So that they can use that summary to, to, to rate you for graduation from what we call the incubator group. And by the way, your week one will be done with you while you're in a group we call the incubator group. So we'll put you inside the incubator group. Once you sign up, you're going to spend one week there and we're going to run these activities with you in the incubator group before we move you to the next um, phase where we're going to be working with you, right? And then in week one, this is where the rubber meets the road. This is where we're going to engage in your first bliss course session with your leader, right? And we're going to make 50 invitations with you under supervision. 
We're going to do this with you. Now, there are some calls you make for yourself. There are some calls we're going to make for you, right? So your leader is going to be making quite some amount of calls with you. Quite some amount of calls, right? He's going to make 50 third-party invitation calls for you. So out of the names you have written, you will give your leader 50 of those names. He's going to call them on your behalf. We're going to send you a message you're going to send to your leader, right? A simple message we'll send to you. You forward the message to your leader, to, sorry, to your friends on the, on the list you've given him. Out of the 150 names, bring out 50 and give to him, right? And you forward the message to 50 of them. And your leader is going to use those, call those 50 people and invite them to take a look at our business. It's a very simple thing. And you too will make some invitations of some people, right? We call them, we, we, we said that we call that your home launch, your home business launch, right? We want you to invite 10 people into your home, into your home. Now, for those of you who don't like people coming to your home, you can have an arrangement somewhere and invite 10 people. That place you have a television set, right? It's a very simple scenario. Out of 10 of them, probably just five of them or Jaraba will come. But you're going to do this on your first week of joining the business. You are launching a business for God's sake that's supposed to pay you over a million naira monthly. Sit up and stop making excuses. Sit up and let us work this simple system with you, right? So we're going to conduct your first home launch. Speak to 10 people. I mean, invite them to your home. Probably five of them might come. If it's not your home, some other place where we'll have a TV. Now, let me tell you how simple the home, the home business system is. Our business grows through sales. And these cells are activated in the homes. Now, let's imagine this scenario. You invite five people to come sit down in your house on a Saturday. And how do you show them the business? Showing them the business is as simple as your leader coming to speak on your behalf. But what if your leader is not available to speak on your behalf that day? What do you do? It's so simple. We have our presentation on YouTube. You can download the presentation into a flash drive, right? Or work, out, work it out to your leader to give you the presentation on a flash drive. Right? You get that presentation and you just plug it into your flash drive, plug your flash drive into your television and press play. That is all you need to do. Let your friends sit down, press play, let them watch, right? Within 30 minutes to one hour, depending on the one that is being played, the presentation will be done. If your friends are watching the video and they decide to leave on time, they don't want to stay to the end and they're leaving, you can easily tell them, John, do you, th do you mean I am not worth one hour of your time? And they will sit back down. Am I not worth one hour of your time, right? If they tell you, eh, is it not uh, like when I be there, I don't want to do the business, blah, 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 blah. You know, but I am worth one hour of your time. Why not you just sit down and watch with me and just encourage me for, for crying out loud? Just as simple as it is, right? Sit down and watch with me. At the end, they will watch. When they are done watching, what do you do? You want to call your team leader to answer their questions. Don't try and be a superhero. Don't try and answer their questions. Call your super, your team leader, let him answer the questions and put the phone on speaker. And he's going to answer the questions to the best of his knowledge. We don't want you talking about the business for now. Yes, we know you can do it on your own, but we know that the prophet is not accepted in his own home. So if you go out to want to do it on your own, you're going to meet a lot of resistance. So let us talk on your behalf, right? Let us show your friends on your behalf. We continue to employ you. Do not go there and start playing superhero. Let us help you speak to your friends on your behalf. We can get two of them to join you from your home meeting. That means the next week, you'll be doing your second home meeting, those two will be doing their first home meeting and they will get their own two two to join them. The week after that, you will be doing your third home meeting. Those two will be doing your, their second home meeting. Then those other four will be doing their first home meeting. And before you know what's happening, your team is going to expand all over the place. This system has created a lot of millionaires and it is designed to help you win. Something as simple as bringing your friends into your house or into any other place you want to put them and press play. If you can press play, you can be a millionaire from our business within six months. This is what you need to do in your first week of joining our business. At the completion of all these activities, of course, your leader can throw in some books, for you, some videos for you to watch, right? Um, at the completion of all these activities, guess what? You are going to graduate from our incubator chat room and then in a graduation ceremony, and then you'll be moved into the place where we're going to be working with you, right? The Kingsman's group, right? And we're going to move you to the next group and then we're going to start working with you. And this will conclude your first week in our business. Remember, it's a five weeks activation program, right? The standard method of operation is a five weeks activation program. And the most busy week for you is week one. And you're just done with week one, with one, with one, week one, right? And you really don't have a lot you even did in week one, right? So you got that settled for week one. Now for week two, you are going to attend your second quick start guide and question and answer session in week two. There's no overdose, right? You are going to attend your second initial planning orientation in week two. You are going to read chapter two and three of your first year in network marketing by Mark Yanel. You're going to engage in your second bliss call session with your leader. Like I said, 50 invitations will be made by you, by us, for you, right? Your leader will make 50 top party call invitations for you. And you will also make some big announcement calls for yourself 
for your home launch. So they will teach you how to make the big announcement call. Very simple script you're going to use. All these scripts are contained in the success manual. So you can use the success manual and use that to transform your own business, right? And that ushers us to the third week, week three. In week three, you attend your third initial planning orientation. You will read chapters four and five of your first year network marketing by Macchiano. You will engage in your third bliss call session with your leader, right? 50 third party call invitation for your downlines will be done as they emerge this time around. So you are the one that will make these calls for your downlines as they emerge. So because in the last two weeks, yours will have been made, but this time around, as your people are joining the business, you are now the one making the third party calls for them. And you also conduct your third home business launch, right? You get that done. So you can see that something different is happening in week three. As your people are joining, it is not the person who signed up, who signed the order is calling for them. You are now the one that's going to make their own invitation calls for them. You see, the extent to which you're going to build your business is going to be directly proportional to the degree to which you are prepared to do this stuff I just mentioned here. Make the calls for your downline using our scripts, how yours was made for you by your upline. If you develop that culture, you're going to build a formidable business. Yes, you're going to be rusty at the beginning. You're going to have some challenges, but you will get better, right? You will get better. Every one of us was rusty at the beginning, but we got better over time, right? Now, in week four, you can see it's almost done. You will attend your fourth initial planning orientation. Very simple. You will reach chapter six and seven of your first year in network marketing by Machianel. You will engage in your fourth bliss call session with your leader, right? You and your leader will do a bliss call session and you will make 15 invitations for your downlines as the downlines are emerging. So you will do that for them again, right? So for, for anybody you sign up into the business, you are going to make from the third week, you're going to make 50 calls for them right? Just like it was done for you. And you will conduct your fourth home launch in week four. Bring five to 10 people to your home again. Let's show them the business. So everybody is going to engage in the home launch four times, four times, after which you now continue running your business like others are doing, right? And of course, in week five, you will learn how to get prospects through referrals using interest forms and from other people who say no to joining the business. You're going to learn that thing with five because you can actually get referrals from people who came to our business, who filled our interest forms, and people who said no to joining the business. You can get referrals from them. You will read chapters eight, nine, and the conclusion of your first year network marketing by Machianel. You will learn social media prospecting, how to prospect using our web link, and how to run Facebook and Instagram ads. You're going to learn all this stuff, right? We're going to teach you how to do them so that you can use them to expand and grow your business right out of your immediate domain. Now, the second part of the initial planning orientation talks about the 444 worksheet. Now, this is quite important, but I want you to understand a concept before we continue. Like I said, the 444 in the 444 worksheet says, teach four people, right, to create, to connect four teammates in four weeks. Teach four to connect four in four weeks, right? But I want you to understand the concept called the connector. Who is a connector? In our business a connector is someone who has satisfactorily completed the smo checklist under the supervision of an effective leader that is who we call a connector someone who has satisfactorily completed the smo checklist under the supervision of an effective leader you see if you want to build your business you must build your business by building connectors a connector is the basic unit of leadership in our business if you are not building connectors you don't have a business because these are the people that will take your business seriously and take your business to the next level. So our job in this business is to build connectors. And who is a connector? A connector is someone who has satisfactorily completed the SMO checklist I showed you under the supervision of an effective leader. So that means it takes at least five weeks to become a connector. Now let's look at the mentality behind the 444 system. What is the mindset behind the 444 system? The 444 system simplifies your business. It makes you understand that your business is not one Herculean, unending task in front of you. It shows you that this is what you need to do. Do it and teach it and reproduce it in your team and create success. It gives you an immediate overview of the health of your business. With the 444 system, the 444 worksheet, you can see and understand and, and, and you know properly track 20 serious-minded people in your business. So it allows you to track the status of 20 connectors in your group from a page, right? So once you are working with your 444 worksheet, you can track these people out and you know how your business is going. It gives you a target to work towards because our business doesn't give you so much targets for you to work, right? You have to develop those targets yourself. But when you are using the 444 system and trying to do it, guess what is happening? You have a target that you are moving towards and when you have a target, they say where focus is 
their energy flows. The four four system gives your business cycle a closure. It doesn't leave your business as one unending thing. You know that, yes, what you need to do is to first of all, fill the worksheet, right? As I will show you. And once you do that, you're going to have a closure. You know that, yes, you have achieved a certain milestone and you are recognized as a connector for achieving that milestone, right? Now you can start and close multiple cycles in our 444 system, which I will explain to you. And you can ascertain by using the, the 444 worksheet, you can ascertain the exact weak point in your business and work on those weak points, weak points, right? I'm going to explain how all that works, works for you. And when tied to our standard method of operation, the 444 worksheet is an explosive tool to make you a millionaire within six months or less and keep you a millionaire forever. Very simple, right? Now, I'm going to show you how the 444 worksheet works. So on your screen now is the 444 worksheet, right? You can see, of course, our name is there, La Buena Vida. Um, La Buena Vida is a Spanish phrase that means the good life, right? Now the 444 worksheet is there, meaning work with four teammates to develop four connectors in four weeks, right? And of course, we have your name, your own name has to be written there under the 444 worksheet where you have work with four teammates, there's space for you to write your name, right? And of course, we have your primary connectors, Primary connectors are those you connected yourself. People you brought into the business yourself, they are your primary connectors. So you refer them and they joined you. Their names are there. One, number one, the name is there. His phone number is there and the date he joined you is there, right? Number two, his name, phone number and date. Number three, name, phone number and date. Number four, name, phone number and date. They are all there in your worksheet, right? Now we have secondary connectors. Secondary connectors are those your primary connectors connected. So those that these four people here connected are your secondary connectors. And you can see the name of primary connector of this guy here is here right his name is there um number one right now let me explain the 444 worksheet using um one of them that has been filled up right so you can look at the worksheet there you can see the primary connectors you can see the name of four primary connectors we have joy ade bola and uchi their phone numbers are there and of course the dates right we're going to be written down there then we have secondary connectors right those your primary connectors connected and of course, you have primary connector one. Primary connector one, you can see the number of primary connectors one here is Joy. So Joy's name is here. Primary connector two, the name is Ade. Ade's name is number two on the primary connectors. Primary connector three, Bola here. Bola's name is number three here on the primary connectors. All right. And number four, Uche. Uche's name is number four there. So you can see secondary connectors. Those your primary connectors connected. So primary connector one, Joy. Four people connected by Joy are Musa, Bala, Usman, and Daniel. Their numbers are there, right? Then I have um, um, primary connector two, Ade. Ade connected three people, David, Peter, and Faith, right? Ade connected three of them. Ade did not connect anybody on number four. So we have primary connector three, Bola connected only two people, Pat and Damilola. And then primary connector four, Uche connected only Chika, Sandra, Wama, and Jumoke, four people too, right? Now, what if I am I am the leader? With this sheet, I can see the success, the, 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 the outlook of my business, right? So I look at primary connector two and number four is missing. And because number four is missing, I'm going to call a day. I say, Ade, why haven't we connected anybody on number four? Let us do big announcements together. Let us work the system. Let us do something and let us get somebody to fill in number four, right? So we'll have your business growing. So it allows me to know when nothing is happening there and also gives me a day's name and I can pick a day's phone number up there, right? And I can easily call him and work with him directly. So when I do this, Ade learns it and Ade does it. Bola learns it and Bola does it. Uche learns it and Uche does it, right? And very not happy, we have a team of people who are doing this and who are teaching this. And then, of course, you have the most formidable and amazing business going for you. So this is what the 444 system looks like. Now, let me explain the 444 fast track system for you, right? If you want to build your business and you want to use the 444 system and to build your business and build your business amazingly fast, right? Let me show you a six months plan using the entry vans. Just one account, right? Using the entry vans. You started with 79,990 naira. You joined us. We plug you into our system. We gave you the SMO checklist. We work the activities with you over the next four weeks to five weeks, right? Let's assume four weeks. And within that four weeks, we are 100% sure that if you do the activities, way more than four people are going to join you. But let's just assume only four of them join you when you follow our system to the letter with us. If four of them join you that month you're going to make 14,000 naira right now that's not all in the second month you're going to plug those four people to us and we're going to work with those four people again because we have a system we have a system we can work with them through zoom physically in the offices and whatever whichever way whatever we want to use so we can get them to join us again 
and we're going to work them, work with them, and we can get each of them to make four connections. In the second month, you are going to make 56,000 naira. Now, that could be the second month. That could even be the second week. Because if you run your home meetings with us in the first week and we do it well with you, you can get four people join you. The next week, we do it with them. That becomes second week. But let us assume second month, 56,000 naira, what comes to you? In the third month, we work with those four of those, each of those four. You're going to have 16, 16 people come in. That's four, 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 joining them. 224,000 naira comes to you. By the fourth month, we work with each of those 16. You have 64, 64, 64, 64. 896,000 naira is paid to you. By the fifth month, 1,024 people are in your team. When you add up all the 256 people that will join your system, you have made 3.5 million naira. By the sixth month, you have over 4,000 people in your team. You have made 8.4 million naira. By six months, this could also be six weeks. If you have that bent on building your business, you're going to create amazing success. But when you're looking for excuses and reasons why it will not work, and you're not engaged in the activity, it's not going to work. This business can pay you really fast if you want it to. Now, if we add up everything you've made here, in total, you have made in six months, 19.1 million naira. What this means is this. Even at 50% success, you've made 9.5 million naira. At 20% success, you've made 3.8 million naira within six months. Is this amazing? Yes, it's amazing. It is amazing. This is the reason why you need to pay attention to this business as much as possible because of the kind of income you can make from this system. It's crazy, right? And this is for those who started with 79,990, running your business that way. What of the man that did the Neovas? 129,990. You make four connections. You've made 42,000 Naira in month one. By month two, 168,000 Naira. By month three, you've made 672,000 Naira. By month four, you've done 2.6 million Naira. By month five, you've done 10.7 million Naira. By month six, you've done 43 million naira. Now, guess what? What if you are only 10% successful, right? 20% successful. By the way, when we add up everything, you will have done about 57 million naira. We'll add up everything in six months. Even if you are 50% successful, that is 28.6 million naira. At 20% success rate, that is 11.4 million naira. At 10% success rate, that is 5.7 million naira. Does it make sense? That you started your business with 129,990, build it, and over six months you have done about 5.7 million. It makes a lot of sense. If only you're able to bend down and let us teach you the system. How about those that came with 259,990, the Technovas, right? In month one, 98,000 naira. Month two, 392,000. Month three, 1.5 million. Month four, 6.2 million. Month five, 25 million. Month six, 100 million. Out of everything, one to three million is what you have done in six months. At 50% success rate, 66 million. At 20% success rate, 26 million. At 10% success rate, 13.3 million naira. Isn't this formidable? Yes, it is, right? I'm showing you potentials and possibilities for you in the business. We have the Digivas. The Digivas you start with 499,990, right? 499,990. It gives you the Digivas. If you have four people join you with the Digivas and we plug them in properly, in right, and we begin to run the digital each person doing 444 the way we showed you in month one, that will be 210,000 in month two, 840,000 in month three, 3.6 million, 3.3 million in month four, 13 million in month five, 3 million in month six, 215 million. If I add up everything, that will bring us to 286 million at 10% success rate, right? At 50% success rate, that's 143 million at 20% success rate, that's 57 million at 10% success rate. That is 28 million. Even at 1% success rate, 2.8 million. Does it make sense that you started a business with 499,990? You run the business and you fail at 1% success rate and you're earning as much as 2.8 million. It makes a world of sense. This tells you the power of this system that we are running, right? So what does it mean to run the 444 system? When we say you're running the 444 system, what does it mean? It means you must attend and understand our initial planning orientation. It means you must understand the standard method of operation checklist our system. It means you must com commit to implementing the standard method of operation checklist. Now, it's not just in understanding, but it is in doing it and in teaching it to your team and ensuring they do it. You must commit to promoting the SMO checklist, uh, checklist doctrine in your team. The standard method of operation doctrine must be promoted in your team. People must eat the SMO checklist, drink the SMO checklist, sleep the SMO checklist. That is going to a large extent determine whether you're going to build a team. Because if you are committed to teaching people the doctrines of the SMO checklist and letting them work with you, work with the system, you're going to create success for yourself. So you must commit to our duplication model. Our duplication model is what is tied to the 44 system. Right? You understand it. So when you follow our model, you will create success for yourself. Right? And our education model is also involves you reordering just six C247. Six retail packs of C247 every month. I think six of them are going to cost you about 16,800 naira. 
but it allows you to rise in the plan as you reorder. And it is not compulsory that you are reordering. It's not compulsory, right? But it is optionally compulsory for people who want to build a big business. So if you want to build a very massive business, right? You want to build a business, you want to rise in the ranks and open other ways you can make money in the business. Speak to your leader and tell your leader you want to start reordering products, right? And they'll plug you in and you're going to reorder your product, grow in ranks and begin to earn even from other places that you um, didn't think are available for you to earn from, right? You must understand the competition plan of our parent company, Empowered Consumerism. Empowered Consumerism is also all called AIM Global. That's the, our paying company, right? The company whose marketing plan we are running. And of course, the final part you need to understand is the challenge 36. This is where millionaires are bred. This is where millionaires are born. This is where you want to run your business like a crazy guy and create crazy income for yourself over a very short period of time. Typically, within two months to three months, right? The challenge 36 strategy using the recruit 20 days game plan is what I'm going to be sharing with you right now. This is the recruit 20 and 30 days game plan, right? What we're going to do with you if you want to run the challenge 36 is that we're going to put you through a fast track system. And remember, you can choose not to do the challenge 36 and run the normal 444 system. Or you can choose to run the challenge 36 and go on a speed lane, right? It's like driving a, a Ferrari and driving a, a Camry, right? You cannot compare them, right? The 444 system is powerful, it's amazing, it's a millionaire program, right? But guess what? This one is the millionaire program on steroids. That is what the 444 Recruit 20 in 30 is all about, right? Now, the, the Challenge 36, so I'm going to be sharing with you the Challenge 36 three months millionaire game plan, right? So pay attention. Now, it is divided into levels. In the first, On the first level of the Challenge 36, you're going to run what you call the Challenge 36 with a goal to recruiting 20 people in 30 days, right? So we're going to sign up 20 people working with you in 30 days, and we're going to generate a total of 36 codes in a month using our fast track system. Your leaders will discuss this with you in depth. This is just making you aware of what is available for you to run and use in our business. So we're going to work closely with you, and together we're going to recruit 20 people to join the business with you over the next 30 days. And from the 20 of them, we're going to generate a total of 36 codes, right? Somebody that comes up with one account can have one code. Then somebody that comes up with the Neovas has one code. Somebody that comes up with the Technovas has three codes. Somebody that comes up with the, with the Mega Digivas has seven codes. Somebody that comes up with the Megavas has 15 codes, right? So we're going to add up the total number of codes and we want it to be up to 36. We're going to show you how it is done and do it with you. That completes your level one. Recruit 20 people, generate that six codes, right? Now, in level two, we're going to work with six out of the 20 you recruited to each reproduce their own level one activity. Now, not everybody is going to want to do the challenge at six, but we want to work with just six people and reproduce their own level one activity. We recruit 20 people in 30 days with them. This can crazily move your business to the next level. So you have to decide, is this what you want or you want to do the normal thing others have been doing, right? And you have to now teach them to do the very simple activity. But whatever the activity we're doing, we're using the SMO checklist still. But this time around, instead of doing the SMO checklist in five weeks, we can compress it in one week or two to create more results for you very fast, right? You'll be making over a million naira monthly at the end of level two. So level two can actually take you two months to get done. You can do level one and level two and three can be done in the second month. So, but with basically within three months, you can complete both levels and you will have been ushered into the one million naira monthly mark, right? So this challenge at six is a leader's hyper track system. This is the default mode for building leaders in our team. If you want to become a leader in the team, people will put you through this system so you can build massively. You know why? Number one, success loves speed. Success loves speed, right? You want to become successful? The faster you're running, the better you are, the more results you create. This pathway is only for those who wish to build very fast and become leaders, right? Everyone who joins the team is introduced to the concept of recruit 20 in 30 days and the 444 system, just like I've done with you, right? So we we'll let you choose your preferred path to wealth. You can choose to go the 444 system gradually, or you can choose to go with recruit 20 in 30. That is the SMO checklist on steroids, right? The millionaire game plan on steroids or whatever you want, you choose, right? This is what we mean when we tell you that all that is standing between you and a million dollar monthly in this business is four in, in 30 days is four people. It's four people. And that's what we're talking about. That is what is standing between you and a million dollar in 30 days. Four people. Look at this illustration I'm going to be showing you shortly. Now, the plan is to start with a massive recruitment drive 
and recruit 20 people in one month. That's a massive drive. Now, we might not get up to 20. No big deal at all. But our target is 20. So we're going for 20. We're not going for 5. We're not going for 10. We're going for 20. And it's so simple to do. We're going to follow it with you hard. And we're going to get 20 people to join you, right? Now, out of the 20, we expect six of them to take up the talent at six. Some will not. Some will. Some would like to do it the normal way. They don't want to be stressed. But some will say, you know what? I am sick and tired of being broke. I want to get this thing out of my life fast. And they'll go to the Challenger 6 with you, right? So you will dedicate months 2 and 3 to working with them to running 20 and 30 and Challenger 6, right? So we're going to dedicate 20, the, the two months to working with these people who join us to create the success that they are also looking for. Our business is about helping people. And as we help you and help them, we build something very fantastic. So make this important and treat it as the norm in your team, right? Let it be what people are hearing about, what people are used to. And when people want to run this, work this with them very, very well. You can achieve this by compressing the SMO checklist. So we don't have to work the SMO checklist in five weeks. We can actually work it in less than five weeks and create success for you, right? So, and we then track everyone we're working with with the 444 worksheet, like I explained to you. So once you sign up somebody, use the 444 worksheet and track them and track the people that they too are signing up and create success for yourself. So look at how it works. It's very simple. Month one, you will recruit 20 in 30 days. Now you might not get to 20, no big deal at all. But 20 is our goal. 20 is our target. And we're going to work very hard with you to recruit 20 people in 30 days, right? Now, guess what's going to happen? Out of the 20 of them, six of them will take the business serious and they want to do exactly what we have done with them, right? So what is going to happen? We are going to work with each of these six people to recruit just four. So in month two, we're going to work with each of them to recruit four, right? And then under each of those four people, we're going to generate a total of 36 codes in the team, right? So we recruited six people. We work with these six people in month two to recruit four each, right? And work with the, the total four of them, the whole lot of the four of them to generate 36 codes each. So it is you recruit six, work with six to recruit four and produce 36 codes in the team. That is what it takes. And this is what your challenge six is going to look like, right? The challenge six is defined by the person running it, not by the people under him. So if one of these six people want to run challenge six, guess what? They will do 20, they will recruit six, and they will work with four of each of those six to recruit four, four, and generate that six codes each. So it is defined by the person on top, not by the people under, right? So it's you who is on top that defines the challenge 36, right? So in conclusion, the standard method of operation and the 444 system we showed you make up what we call our 444 system. This is a formidable system that we have used to build this business and amazingly transform the lives of people in our team. We challenge you, whatever is going to take you to run this system with us, don't make excuses. The systems are simple. The systems have been done and reproduced by others. These systems have created millionaires before you. This system will also make you a millionaire if and only if you pay attention. If you pay attention, we will work with you, teach you the system, run the system with you, and together we're going to create something very formidable. Don't complicate the system. Use it as simple as it is. By the grace of God, through this system in C2NFG, we have been able to produce over 2,000 monthly millionaires. Our target is getting to 50,000 monthly millionaires by the year 2024. The big question is, will you be one of them? Right? If you know you want to be one of them, focus. Get back to your leader. Tell your leader you've gone through the IPO and then sit down with your leader and map out the first week activity and begin to run the activities. Even if they are not available to help you, don't wait on them. Don't wait for them, rather. Right? Take this video, watch it again, jot out all the things you need and get started immediately. If your leaders are not available, jump them. Go to the person above them. If that one is not available, go to the person above them. Somewhere in your upline, you will find somebody who is who is ready to work with you because your success is the person's success. Thank you so much for being with us. This completes the, the, the initial planning orientation. Take it serious and let's build with you. Other trainings will be coming your way as you advance in the business. God bless you all.